Welcome to Deck Check, the series where I check out a game and let you know how it plays on deck. Today, I'll be taking a look at Dome Keeper, an indie survival roguelike created by developer Bip and Bits. I'll be going over compatibility, controls, graphic settings, and overall feel, and giving the game a final rating based on how well it plays on deck. If you find this content helpful, go ahead and subscribe. I'm trying to grow the channel, and every subscription helps a ton. First of all, Dome Keeper has no compatibility issues and starts up just fine on the deck with no hassle whatsoever. Compatibility for games can change over time though, so I recommend checking the comments to see if anything has changed in the time since this video was posted and leaving a comment yourself if you have any issues. Dome Keeper has full controller support and with its stylish UI and gorgeous pixel graphics, it looks fantastic on the deck's small screen. Having said that, it does have one rather serious issue with its UI, small text size. The text for most everything in Dome Keeper was clearly not made with the deck's small screen in mind. If it was any smaller, it would be actually unreadable. Now, I'm someone who tends to not have issues reading very small text, but if you do, then this will almost certainly be a deal breaker. On the plus side though, this game actually has very little text in it. In the few times you have to read text, the game is paused to give you plenty of time to read. This mitigates the issue somewhat, although I would love to see an option for bigger text size added in the future. The game's simple pixel art style causes it to have both incredible performance and battery life on the Steam Deck. How incredible? With all the default settings, I was getting well over six hours of battery life playing Dome Keeper. There's very little to tone down in terms of graphic settings. However, if you wanted to manually dial in clock speeds, you could probably squeeze out even more battery life. Overall, Dome Keeper is a fantastic little game to play on deck, provided the small text size isn't an issue for you. With its exceptional battery life, it's a great game to have in your library if you're going to have to go quite a while without access to a charger and want to squeeze out every last minute of gameplay you can. Most modern games simply don't have this sort of battery life on deck, and Dome Keeper is possibly the best I've seen yet outside of emulated classics. I plan to make many more Steam Deck videos, so if you don't want to miss out, go ahead and subscribe, and leave a like while you're at it. And if you have any games you'd like to see me cover in the future, leave a comment letting me know. Your comments have been very helpful in letting me know what videos I should make next. Until then, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.